guys i haven't done a vlog in a while so i thought i would vlog today i think i'm gonna do a couple of days and join them together but yes grayson's at nursery today so it's like an r d type day i feel bad because normally i'm like editing and filming today but i've just got so much other crap stuff to do i need to go into town and get my eyebrows done because it's much easier without a three-year-old and steph's gonna go and get haircuts so we're gonna go in together now and get some food because we're both starving and we've eaten all the food in our house and then we've got to come home and do boring tax stuff which i definitely won't vlog but i thought i would vlog our little trip in town anyways i want to show you my little bump because it's really sticking out now i can't believe this baby's gonna be massive i don't know if you can see that probably can't hang on proper little bump <laughs> my outfit of the day is my jacket's from all saints it was my christmas present my dress <laughs> i'm wearing all black my dress was from top shop it's not maternity but i can just about squeeze into it but i know they do a maternity one like this so i think i'm gonna try and find it while we're in there today um tights are top shop maternity and boots are just from asda which i've worn to death but yeah i think because the place that we're gonna go for lunch or for food is actually in Topshop. Um, they've got this really nice little cafe that does like salads and sandwiches and things. Um, so we're gonna go and grab a snack in there and then hopefully I've got time to go and have a look at the maternity bits because I've got like, <laughs> I think I've got about four things that fit me right now and they're all on rotation constantly. So I'll see what's in there. Always faffing around Mitchellack. <laughs> I swear to God, I look like 24 weeks pregnant. <laughs> Ooh, my Larry. <laughs> How much do you love that we're going for lunch in Topshop? No. <laughs> I Steph's like, no, don't make me eat in Topshop, but the cafe's really good. When I was younger, my friend got scouted in here and I was really annoyed all day that I didn't get scouted. <laughs> Oh god, help me somebody. Right, we need to go down the next set as well. I don't know how you pronounce it, Ben Benugo, but they do such good salads and sandwiches and smoothies. So it's nice and healthy. What do you think, Steffi? Are you glad we came to eat here? So good, so good. You're all blurry, but never mind. Found myself a little maternity t-shirt dress. It's very me. <laughs> it's basically grey. Everything in my wardrobe is grey. Oh my god. My mum used to have these plates. <laughs> they sell them in Liberties now. I think we got ours from a boot sale. <laughs> Right, eyebrows are done and the man is groomed. I'm exhausted now. Pregnancy really does take it out of you. Literally all we've done is come to town, eat some food and be groomed and I'm like ready for a nap. It's a shame, I've got to go home and spend two hours doing taxes. Taxes. Oh, I hate adult life sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Steph and I have just spent the last two hours doing our taxes we're still not finished but he has gone off to go and get gracie now and i'm so tired i feel like all i've done in this vlog is say i'm so tired but god like pregnancy does make you so tired i feel like i jinxed myself because i said that i didn't really get very tired in my first trimester and now it's kind of hit me um by the way randomly really loving eating carrots right now just raw carrots <laughs> They're really good snack, they fill you up and they're good for you. I thought I would show you quickly something a little bit geeky. Kiehl's sent me some of their uh, midnight recovery uh, products to try out, which are amazing by the way. Uh, but they sent this beautiful, beautiful reef. Um, it's like a lavender reef with it. And look, we've made it into a centerpiece <laughs> for our table with some flowers that I got from Sainsbury's. Um, but we just put the reef round the vase 
because I don't really have anywhere to hang a wreath in my house and the area that we live in, if we hang it on the front door, it'll definitely get nicked in like the space of probably about half an hour. So I just put it there and I think it looks really nice. It does look so random, but quite pleased with it. My eyebrows look so dark in this, don't they? <laughs> I'm just gonna put Gracie's um, bed sheets, oops. I'm just gonna put Gracie's bed sheets on to dry because I forgot and he needs to go to bed in like two hours. <laughs> I forgot to hang them out. Um, I'm gonna go and put some of his washing away before he gets back as well. Wouldn't you love it if someone did all that for you? All right, I'm just gonna wash your bed sheets, do all your washing, cook your dinner, clean up after you, give you a bath, that'd be amazing. But yeah, I'm gonna do that before he gets back. I said I was gonna sit down and have a rest, but I just can't help myself from pottering. Is anyone else like that? Oh, by the way, sorry about my eyebrows <laughs> every time i vlog recently it's right after i get my eyebrows tinted and they look really weird right i need to go and put washing away <laughs> guys look what's happened this is a tired child after nursery and he's just fallen asleep after his bath now i have to do a transfer it's not gonna go well Breakfast. Good morning. It is probably not the morning anymore. Actually, Daddy I have no idea what time is it is. Daddy's coming over today. What, Gracie? Daddy's coming over today. Stefan's leaving us. I thought you were always the one that packed all the stuff, and I was like, I was a light packer, but I don't think I am. Check out how much luggage Steph has got just for himself for a week snowboarding. Isn't that ridiculous? I think that's ridiculous. Thank God we're not coming. No, Imagine, do I don't think we'd be able to. We would, there'd be no room for us. But yeah, I think we are just going to have a little hour alone together, aren't we, before you leave me for a week? I get really anxious when Steph goes away snowboarding. I always think he's gonna have like some hideous accident and like die on the mountain. <laughs> so I always tell him to like, just send me like one kiss every like couple of hours so I know he's alive. I'm just really neurotic, I think. Thanks for changing the bins before you go. Oh, I've got to do the man's job for the week. Oh, yeah, it's very sexy. I know, but it is your job. I <laughs> don't wanna do that. We are just about to have a little circuit around the park on Gracie's bike before Steph has to leave but I thought I would just show you my outfit of the day quickly. It looks like this. Oh I'm not in focus. I've got my, you're so dark sorry, um, I've got my t-shirt dress that I bought yesterday from Topshop and there's the bump. Hi bump. And then my jacket is like a drapey khaki jacket, which is from All Saints last year. And then tights are maternity top shot and boots are uh, Asda again. Daddy! Yes. Let me go! No, I'm not letting you down ever again. Five years. You can stay here. No, no, no. No. Come back. Come back. <laughs> Just out for our little walk, and um, we've been asking Grayson for ages what we think, what he thinks we should call the new baby. And most of the time, we get poo poo or bum bum. Today, we got friendship and Luna girl. <laughs> Hannah just uh, took a photo of us, a selfie of us, because she thought it might potentially be the last photo we ever had together. Yeah, because I get scared that you're gonna like get <laughs> smothered by an avalanche or like have some crippling accident. I wasn't putting my like last photo face either, weren't you? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, we better retake it then. <laughs> How are we, partner? I challenge you to a draw. draw, draw. A, a draw. Three. You look two, so cute. <laughs> Good morning. It is now Tuesday, I think. I'm very aware that this vlog is very sporadic. I think I've jumped from Saturday to Tuesday. <laughs> I did vlog at the weekend, but then my camera was on the wrong setting the whole time, so it was all completely pointless. I thought I would do a little bit of a, like a, a real mummy morning routine. 
just to make this vlog even more random than it already is. I've got my little buddy in bed with me. Hello. Say good morning. He's playing with his transformers. Oh, he's pretending that they're Owlet and Gecko from PJ Masks. It's his favourite cartoon. But Gracie slept in bed with me last night. Normally I put him to bed in his bed and then he comes into our bed at some point in the night, every night, um, and we end up co-sleeping. And I don't mind because the bed's like really, really big, so it doesn't really bother either Steph or I. But last night you came in a little bit earlier, didn't you? Did I did 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 uh, uh, when I did my pajamas when I just go to bed they was there was that was wet. Yeah, you had a little accident, didn't you? But it's okay, because everyone has accidents sometimes. In bed. Yeah. Eat and Charlotte and Tabby and Lulu. Yeah, everybody has accidents. But yeah, anyway, so he... I went to bed super early last night. At like Mommy, half did, past eight. You did you yourself. No, I didn't wee myself. Yes, you did. But Gracie that. woke up at like half eleven or something after his accident, so he took Steph's side of the bed last night because Steph is still skiing. I've started to really miss him now. I'm like, oh, my husband back. I don't miss tripping over his shoes and his coffee cups being everywhere yet, but I'm sure I will in the next couple of days because I'm like, I'm so not used to being away from him and it's not, I don't know, it's just hard. Especially because the time difference is like eight hours as well. So we've had a couple of FaceTime chats, but nothing on what we would normally i mean normally we're in the house together every single day so ow that's my boob <sighs> there's nothing worse than like having your boobs bash when you're pregnant because your boobs are so sensitive i try not to go on my phone actually in the mornings now until after breakfast just because i kind of like that little morning lull that you get where you're just sleepy and yeah, it's just nice not to be online. And now I am just chatting crap again. <laughs> Should we let Widgie in? Later. Later? Poor Widgie. Look at your bed hair. <laughs> Daddy says he wants me to get your hair cut. I don't know how I feel about getting Grayson's hair cut. I really like the length it is right now. Steph always really likes it short. I always think he looks so grown up when he's got shorter hair. But it does make him look neater. You're very scrappy. My little scrappy. Bitchy! Hello. Bitchy's come to join us for a little lion. so loud. Breakfast time. Gracie and I pretty much have porridge every single day. Um, we didn't when I was three months pregnant because the look and the texture of porridge made me want to be sick. <laughs> so he had to like not eat it too and we just had cereal and toast and fruit salad and stuff. But um, now I'm absolutely fine with it so we're back on the porridge. And what I usually do is I make it on the hob and I make it with mostly almond milk and like a little splash of semi-skimmed milk as well. Add the fridge. Grayson's going through this phase where he is absolutely amazing at playing by himself. So in the mornings when I'm making breakfast, he will literally just play by himself and whisper and it's really cute. Um, I used to always come upstairs and put the TV on straight away but we don't do that anymore. I kind of save that for if he's kind of getting a bit bored and I need to get ready, um, like get dressed and maybe come and get snacks ready and stuff and that's when I use my TV sneaky mum trick. So this is our finished breakfast. I've got 
porridge with raspberries, blueberries, maple syrup and a bit of peanut butter. Grayson has porridge with chopped up banana and honey. Breakfast is ready, Gracie. My little breakfast date. <laughs> We've both got our big um, bottles of water that I normally just chop up some fruit and put that in. And then Grace's got his apple juice, I've got my orange juice. You've got a strawberry in your water today. Washing up time. Scientists say that physical activity... Time to hang out the washing. Washing is done, second load is now in. Now it is finally time for me to just sit down for 10 minutes with my cup of tea. I do this every single day after I've cleaned up after breakfast and Grayson's still playing nicely. And I'm just gonna check my emails and have a little look on my social media. Yeah, I like this time of day because he's always really, really content just to play. So I should really be getting ready, but I just like to sit here and relax for 10 minutes because generally it's the only time I really sit down. Just come down to have a quick wash while Gracie is still playing. And at the moment I am using this cleansing oil from Kiehl's, which I very kindly got sent to try out. I'm not sure if it's out yet or not, but it is absolutely amazing and I love it. And I've used it every day since they've sent it to me and I use it in the evening as well. And breathe. Um, so I'm gonna wash my face with that and then I'm going to go upstairs and make mine and Grace's second breakfast because usually by now we're both hungry again. <laughs> Before I resort to TV, which I usually save until I'm doing my makeup, I let Gracie play with his, he's got a leap start, um, I think it's leapfrog leap start activity like thing. <laughs> I don't know what it's called. But basically you buy different books and you put them inside and they kind of are educational and they teach you things and they've got activities and stuff. Kind of similar to an iPad, but I wanted something where he wasn't looking at a screen. He seems to really enjoy it. We've got special shape toast. Here. You ready? Ta da! <laughs> this is completely unrelated to any morning routine, but Gracie did a painting at nursery yesterday, and I felt really proud of him because he doesn't normally venture into the arts and crafts world without a lot of encouragement and every day when I drop him off or every time he goes to nursery I always say to him you're gonna paint me a picture today paint on me a picture today and he never does and yesterday he came out with this and I just I don't know I just got that like really nice feeling you get when you're a mum where you just feel really proud even though it's like a painting but I just felt like oh he finally did it so yeah it was a moment for me Gracie's favourite show is on. Which means I'm gonna take my window to put a bit of makeup on. I don't think I'm gonna film actually doing my makeup because I did a like makeup, daily makeup routine quite recently. Um, but I was thinking, oh, I wonder if there's anything new that I've used since that video. And it's not new, but I have fallen back in love with a different highlighter, which I am now layering on top of the Clinique one that I use every day anyway. Um, and it's this Becca highlighter and it's called Shimmering Skin Perfector Pressed. And at first I didn't like it, it was kind of too orangey for me, but I think now I'm trying to kind of dabble in slightly different toned blushes and things, I have kind of fallen in love with this. I just think it gives such a nice like, really makes your skin like glow. You don't need very much of it, but look what happened a while ago. It was a really sad day. Now comes the dilemma of what to wear because there's only a few things that actually fit over my belly right now. I think I'm gonna wear the black jeans I wore yesterday. I think they are here. These are maternity jeans. These are actually my maternity jeans that I had when I was pregnant with Grayson. I wore them yesterday and they've been screwed up on that chair all night. You know when it's too dirty for the wardrobe but because you've worn it but not dirty enough? to wash so it goes on the chair but uh, yeah they're really good they're just quite I don't really like them they're quite 
baggy around the leg um but i hate jean shopping so i think i'm just gonna live with those <laughs> then i think i'm gonna go for this big chunky grey Topshop jumper which isn't maternity but is just really big and baggy. I wore this, I realised, I think it was last week's Michelin vlog, I pretty much wore this four days out of five which is really gross but it's so comfortable I can't help it. Do Gracie's outfit. Um, I got him these which I haven't put him in yet. Oh. Excuse the unmade bed. Yeah, I haven't put him in these yet. They are so cute though. They're just from Zara. So I think we'll put those on today with, hmm, does that go or is that too many patterns? I think that's quite cute. I was too tired to wash my hair last night and so I'm just going to dry shampoo it tonight. I'm not going to bother doing anything to it because Gracie and I are just going to go to the park around the back of our house with one of his little friends and then probably do some baking or something this afternoon because the weather's not very nice so I'm not going to bother making any sort of effort today so I'm just going to chuck some dry shampoo in my hair this is the Reef Krillies, um Colab dry shampoo and it is my favourite because it doesn't smell horrible I hate the smell of dry shampoo What are you doing? I'm working You're working? <laughs> Careful You're getting a shot just made us a couple of little packed lunches for the park because we're going to be there over lunchtime. So Grayson has a cheese and ham sandwich on brown bread in there. We've got an orange each. Gracie's got some blueberries, some raisins. I'm going to share this carrot. I feel like we're just going to snap it in half. Um, normally I cut them up for him, but I think if he sees me eating it whole, he'll want to do the same. Banana for Grace. Baby Bell for Grace. We've got like this... Um, energy bar each not that he leaves any any energy at all but i really like it and so does he and i don't want to share <laughs> so i put one in, one each in and then i've got a cheese ham and tomato sandwich a deliciously ella energy ball and some nuts and seeds too i find i have to make myself snacks as well when whenever i take gracie out in the mornings now just because I just get constantly hungry and I hate being stranded somewhere and he's having a good time and thinking oh I really want to leave because I'm starving so I just bring myself out food now. Time to get dressed little one. Ah, let me see you. My popcorn. <laughs> That's pretty much it. We are now ready to go. So that's my like mummy morning routine. Sorry that it wasn't um, beautifully filmed like all the rest of the morning routines on the internet. And also for the randomness of this video, like it's just so random. It's been just like a few days squashed together. So it is really random, but I hope you liked watching it anyway. I'll see you guys all in my next video. Bye. He's stuck apparently. <laughs> Right, I'm gonna go and wear him out in the park. <laughs>